Well, this is interesting. John Amos says he doesn't know why his daughter Shannon started a GoFundMe account. Yesterday, the story broke that he was in the hospital and he had been financially exploited and abused. But TMZ spoke directly to Amos. He said it's all a lie. Wow, this is crazy. The actor said he has been in the hospital due to fluid traveling in his abdomen causing heart issues. Amos says there's no elder abuse or financial exploitation, but his daughter has since responded to the TMZ story. Here is what she had to say, courtesy of the Neighborhood Talk. Hey, it's me again. Uh, I just saw that a TMZ story broke. Half of the story broke. Uh, there's definitely another side to that story. Um, so I'm alive here. Hello, everyone. I uh, see that a TMZ story broke, and um, unfortunately, it says some really like that I made this up, which is not true. And so I would invite TMZ to do some accurate reporting and check with the Colorado Bureau of Investigations to see if there is in fact a real case because there is and I am not crazy so um, thank you TMZ for breaking the story but I want you to report it accurately and all due respect to um, my father's response I understand that um, this is embarrassing and upsetting and probably not what he would have wanted me to do but it is in his best interest and to um, the travel agent pretending to be a real publicist, Belinda Foster. Yeah, um, for real, really? Come on, like, we already, this story is, you all have no idea what is really going on. And because I don't want to have any defamation of character or slander, I can't name names yet, but, do some homework. I invite you all to do some homework. Do a little digging. Do a little research and figure this out for yourselves. This is real. And um, TMZ, if you're watching, um, I've sent you my number. And you are more than welcome to reach out to me for the real story. Um, my reputation and integrity is everything. And my family, my lawyers, and um, my dad's closest friends are standing with me on this. Yes, closest family and friends. And so um, I hope that justice is served. Uh, I understand that this isn't the narrative that uh, my father would like to put out, but I'm going to stand in the truth because one thing I know that if I don't, this is going to happen again and again and again. And so far, this person has gotten away with this, and it's not going to happen this time. I don't care where we have to go. I'm not going through this again. So, TMZ, if you're there and you want the real story, call me up. Call me up. I'm happy to share. And actually, I would actually rather go to a credible, uh, newsworthy outlet and share the real story because I have the real story and I have the receipts. All of the receipts. So, um, I hope you all will support me in this. I promise you, with everything that I have, this is the truth. And I know there's going to be trolls, and I know there's going to be backlash. I knew that when I stepped into this space and decided to share publicly. And I'm doing it, whether my dad likes it or not, to protect his best interest, to protect my family's best interest, so that the perpetrator or perpetrators will go to jail this time. Um, you know, unfortunately, law enforcement hasn't really had um, been able to do this, and this is why we have lawyers, and this is why we're doing the things that we're doing. So um, my GoFundMe campaign, TMZ, is for a real purpose, and that is to protect and uh, take care of my dad in this time. And um, I would love to see the credentials of Miss Foster, and if she has them, Good for you, um, but I'm going to just say this, that I have all the receipts, all of them, photos, videos, everything, so, 
and just check with Colorado Bureau of Investigations and you'll get the truth. So I'm signing out now. I'm sending love and light to everyone. Um, you know, when you walk in your truth and when you walk with integrity, trust me, doors swing wide open. The people who are playing the games, who are pulling the strings, who are manipulating even my father or his words, it's all going to come out. What My grandmother used to say, what doesn't come out in the wash will come out in the rinse. So I um, am sending love to everyone, and I'm sending prayers and blessings and um, continued healing to my dad. And I hope that justice is served. Thank you so much, y'all. And um, share this story, share this. And at TMZ, um, you know how to reach me. I'm right here.